Hi, and welcome to Click Fix. In this video, we're going to talk about connectivity issues when working with ClickSense in the Hub. Users might get a communication error like connection lost. If so, it probably looks something similar to this. And it always happens in the Hub or the script editor, which can cause the developer to lose some code when refreshed. The main reason for this is the WebSocket communication was blocked, failed, or timed out. This is caused by certain device connection idle settings within that network, which makes it very hard to find the device and fix or increase the timeout. In the release of ClickSense June 2018 patch 1, there was a configuration setting introduced to help get around this issue called WebSocket Interval. We're going to take a look at that now. If we go to the ClickSense server and to this location, C drive, program files, click, sense, proxy, and open the config file called proxy.exe.config using notepad, you can see that there is a new value called WebSocket Ping Interval. By default, it's set to zero. In some instances, you may not have this inside the config file. If that's the case, you will need to add it inside of app settings and set the value to 60. Of course, to change this file, you will need to first stop the ClickSense proxy service. So stop the service, make this change to the config file, and restart the ClickSense proxy service. Once you do this, your communication should continue. The pinging between the client and the server should continue to take place every 60 seconds. This settings change will hopefully resolve any timeout issues. If, however, the device setting is already less than 60 seconds, you could consider lowering this ClickSense proxy ping interval setting to lower than 60. It will continuously ping and add more communication across your network, so if you need to set it lower than 60, you may need to experiment a bit with trial and error to find the setting that works best in your environment. But our recommendation is 60. I hope that helped. If not, or you'd like more information, please search in the support portal. Thanks for watching. Nailed it.